my brothers and sisters hello everyone come with the sign on the hat and of course come by one minute son pastor janto here on this blessed holy sunday evening ah yes it's quite the fine sunday evening my brothers and sisters and i just like to say my riri pillow is being very effective the riri pillow 9000 always effective but man i had a great sleep last night my brothers and sisters probably had something to do with the uh, seeing Didi in a wedding dress on Google. Woo! That set a tone in my brothers and sisters, you know. It just it just can't be defined anymore, my, bro my brothers and sisters, you know. Whatever type of measurement you try to use, metric system, American system, it does not matter, my brothers and sisters. It's just set a tone in. It's just what it is. But anyway, my brothers and sisters, what is today's holy factual problem? Well, my brothers and sisters, I know what some of you guys may think sometimes. All of these holy Sundays, and yet, we do not have these signs of any natural religion. And don't worry, my brothers and sisters, it does not matter. Because our religions are built different. Listen, all these all these religions, right, they got Bibles and all this stuff. Listen, the search of really sub videos on YouTube, that's your Bible. That's, that's the only Bible you need in life, my brothers and sisters. That's what I live by. Listen, what Riri says goes, it is factual. It's immediate. And then I spit it to all of you because I only spit facts, my brothers and sisters. But you know what? I decided, you know, to try and get, you know, more, more people to come over to the cult of Riri, you know. So my brothers and sisters, I have decided to get a little bit more mainstream, you know, how it is these days. Listen. And don't worry, none of that creepy mainstream stuff like touching little kids, you know, forcing them to call us on each other. No, my brothers and sisters, this is a real religion, my brothers and sisters, do not worry. So I've decided everyone to proclaim the holy trinity of Lili, my brothers and sisters, that is right. That is right, my brothers and sisters, a classic, absolute classic. Maybe a little bit of a plagiarism here, but do not worry, completely original. It is not the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, my brothers and sisters. It is simply the Holy Trinity of waifus, my brothers and sisters. Now, for anyone who might be confused, of course, Riri is a voice actor. So, of course, she has a Holy Trinity of waifus that she has voiced, you know. And who are, who is this Holy Trinity of waifus? Well, my brothers and sisters, you may recognize some of these absolutely legendary names among all anime fans. First off, Megumin. Come. Come on, my brothers and sisters. Iconic. Iconic. You've you've heard that explosion more than once. I'm not even gonna try to replicate it, because to try and replicate Lily's voice is is a crime among itself. You know, automatic execution. You know, teleportation to the bottommost of the ninth realm. My brothers and sisters, we know what goes on here. We know what it is. We know what the process is. My brothers and sisters, not even gonna try it. But yes, she does voice Megumin. In fact, from Konosuba, absolutely legendary waifu, best girl without a doubt, no doubt in my mind. Where is season three? We all want season three. Who is next, my brothers and sisters? The second part of the Holy Trinity. Amuria, my brothers and sisters. That is right, from Lee Zero herself, the best waifu. Listen, I know some of y'all might say that Rem is best waifu. Rem is better waifu than Amuria. And you know what? I can understand that sentiment, my brothers and sisters. If she wasn't voiced by Didi, them would have been best waifu. I'm not even gonna lie, my brothers and sisters. Yes, I'm not even gonna lie. But you know what? She's voiced by Didi, so she is best waifu. That is all there is to it. It is factual. I only spit facts, my brothers and sisters. The second part of the Holy Trinity is immediate. Now the third, ar arguably the most powerful. No, no one in anime could win a fight against her. Not even Goku himself, you know. Zeno-sama, you know, someone who's even stronger than Goku. Eliminate the universe with his pinky could even beat this waifu. Of course, I'm talking about Takagi-san from Karakai Jozo no Takagi-san. Yes, now, undebatably, I'm not someone who usually has, you know, favorites or anything like that. I, you know, I just love everything, you know. Other than Riri, of course, who is my favorite everything. You know, you know, favorite anime, favorite song, you know. I usually don't have those. I just have stuff that I love to listen to or watch. But you know what? Kanagai Jozo no Takagi-san along with Konosuba and Zero are up there for my favorite anime of all time. And it only makes sense that DD voices all the waifus in there. And like I said, no one's beating Takagi-san in a fight, you know? Her, 
Her teasing is just too powerful. There's a reason Jozu is in the title, which means skilled. Anyway, my brothers and sisters, yes. So if you had any doubts that this was not, you know, an authentic religion, my brothers and sisters, the cult of Didi, if you even had those doubts in your mind, fear not, because we have our own holy trinity right here, and it's the holy trinity of waifus, my brothers and sisters. So for today's holy factual proverb, you know, in the name of Megumin Emilia and uh, Takagi-san, we bless upon Lady. That's 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 the <laughs> that's that's the new, that's the new thing. No Father, Son, Holy Spirit here, my brothers and sisters. No, no, no. We have Megumin Emilia and Takagi-san, my brothers and sisters. That that's today's factual holy proverb. That's that's the process we follow now. Yes, the the factual holy proverb is a new announcement, my brothers and sisters. But anyway, this has been Pastor John to this holy Sunday. I, I, I will see you guys next time. As always, uh, praise and share the Trinity, of course. And uh, as always, peace out and bless upon the